What's going on guys? This is Eric from Strygas Gaming and welcome back to another edition of Easter Egg Hunt. This week we're going to be taking a look at Scribblenauts Unlimited and checking out some of the things that you can spawn when you type just random stuff into the dictionary. This first one that I did is Maxwell. When you do this, Maxwell for the record is your character, the guy that I'm controlling right now. It'll spawn an evil Maxwell and that green notebook that he uses, you see that just kind of stuff randomly spawning out of it. That's essentially all that it does. Every time that you use that item, it's going to spawn a random item. And so you'll see this time, when I use it, it spawns a metallic T-Rex. Another time, tiny dinosaur. And another time, a bowl of something. I don't know what that was. Anyway, if you type in business cat, it's actually going to spawn in something that the developers have created themselves to kind of insert into the game. So you'll see the popular meme business cat pop into the world here. And then if you type in Nyan Cat, you're going to spawn in the very popular kitty cat who's got a popped out of her body and is pooping rainbows as it flies through the air. Um, now, somehow I got it stuck in a tree, so I had to go get that up. Now, there are a few objects that you can type in that are going to look very mundane to begin with, but they actually have a lot of significance and are probably some of the better Easter eggs that you'll find in this. So, for example, this one's Time Machine. If you time travel, It'll turn everything sepia tone and put Maxwell in a very, very old, oldie time uniform. Um, and as you can fly through, you'll notice that you get the general film grain that you get from those times, as well as just general film damage. When you type in game, it's going to spawn in a Game Boy. And then when you click play on that, it's going to show you a very low res world. Well, low res in quotes, because it's still full resolution I'm playing this in 1080p um, but it's gonna pixelate everything and then when you type in arcade it's gonna do much of the same thing except for the fact that instead of the monochrome look that the Game Boy produced this one's gonna produce more of like 8-bit graphics or 16-bit whatever you want to do it's gonna mash the or squish the colors down to a much more simple color palette now this is just a small selection of the things that you can type into the dictionary that'll produce some popular memes or some funny things that'll spawn into the world. If you guys like this video, please throw a like on it. Subscribe to our channel, Strygas Gaming. If you know of any other entertaining things that you can type into Scribble Knots, let us know in the comments. And we'll see you again next week in another edition of Easter Egg Hunts. Take care, guys.